Oh, did we get the predictions for this one? Yeah, we got it, we got it, we got it. Oh, uh, okay, I just asked you. I'm not in the Twitch chat, so... I got it, yeah. Uh, so far, 76% of Twitch chat says Burst will win. And then while 24%, 23% now, actually, says TM4 will win. Actually, the whole chat's pretty much saying Burst is going to take this one, so we'll see. Yeah, off the bat, uh, I can already see Burst really making use of that double jump armor to escape a lot of these these nest strings. I mean, he's still taking a lot of damage, but he's not getting like sent off stage. So that's kind of good for him. Still though, the amount of percent that TM4 is able to put on very quickly can't be understated. Really nice side magnet stall into the down there. Oh. Pretty rough spot to be in off stage, but Burst is really, really Ooh. smart with his egg use to get back. Yeah, tough trade though. for Burst though. Yeah, yeah. He's at such a high percent that trade in there was just not good for him. Ooh, but wow. Nearly with the up tilt up air. That up tilt actually has a really good range on it. Because I think that's his up tilt. I can't tell. <laughs> I can't tell if it's F tilt or up tilt. That was up tilt. But I knew, doesn't this F tilt also send them up in this game? I think it does. Yeah. Jeez. Such good spacing with the back air. Dash tag, enough. not enough though, but still sending Burst off the stage. TM4, I was gonna say, looking for this back air because he knows how Burst might try to recover. Oh, a lot of percent there got popped up pretty high. Yeah, and Dash okay, tag will do it at the high percent. Yeah. <laughs> pretty disjointed, really long lasting hitbox. Wow, just enough to kill. That up air hitbox is pretty deceptive for it to hit off the ground like that. It's a standing miss. I didn't think it would reach like that. You didn't get the tech chase there, but TM4 is always ready for that, like, miss chat. Uh, tech to like, uh, oh no, no not uh. again. <laughs> uh, <laughs> dude, this happens, this happens so much. This, this happens so often, dude. You know what's crazy? It happens when the room is first made. I don't know, I don't know what to say. It's on our side. It ends up happening every time we first make the room. Like when the room is first made and we watch two people play, it'll happen one time and then it never happens again. Oh, so this is a whole new. This arena. whole new, yeah. Because remember, we were on a break for like twenty minutes. Ah, uh, right. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. We were, we were like, <laughs> "Yo, what's up, Phoenix? How's it going, man? Good to see you here on the stream." Yeah, we went on break for 20 minutes, so I had to remake the room. It happens on, like, four other tournament Smash streams, too. It's just a thing, dude. I mean, we already found that the Nintendo's Wi-Fi servers are from, like, Windows 97, 94, <laughs> whatever. So, like, if that says anything, <laughs> we're just going to have to wait until Nintendo fixes their servers. I think later this month, they announced that they're changing the servers for um, Monster Hunter Rise to update for that game specifically. So, we'll be getting better servers. Yeah, Splatoon 2 will recognize if your game is running on a Windows 94 server. Or Windows 98. <laughs> one of the two. I don't remember which one. It's literally Nintendo's fault. The servers are old. They need to update these. That's so insane. Like, why are they using that in using 2021? They're using Windows 98 servers, bro. This is wild. <laughs> 20 year old servers, man. And we have to pay 
Some of, dude, some of these servers are as old as the kids who play this game. <laughs> That's wild. They're older dude. than them. They're older than the people playing the game. Uh, Let's see. Anyway, on to game two. Sorry, just I really, the end tangent. I really... like, we don't even play for online, bro. What we pay for is like Nintendo games that are from like the Super Nintendo and the NES. That's what we pay for, emulators on our console. Anyways, yeah, let's go back to this game. Yeah, I really like how aggressive TM4 is beating this matchup. Ooh, missed tech, but uh, not, not in position for the job lock, unfortunately. Yeah, I think TM4 recognizes that Burst is going to try to use his double jump armor out of his multi-hit moves regardless of what he does, so he will just keep, you know, attacking to punish yeah. him. Oh, I like that drag down back air, but... Ooh, what oh, what a catch. Okay. Uh, I, I'm, I, if I'm a TM4, I'm fine with that trade, honestly. That did a lot of percent, even though he dropped the stock. Oh, huge, huge reverse. That was very good string. So much damage already. Oh, excellent now yeah. from the parry. Also getting the cross up on burst. Excellent down smash too. It's good too because Yoshi might have to burn the double jump, and since Down Smash has such an active hitbox behind it and in front of it as well, sorry, I'm mostly behind it, it's just good to get it out there and challenge Yoshi that way to edge guard. Yeah, even with the double jump armor, we'll have a rough time dealing with the Down Smash. Exactly. Oh, nice catch. Oh, nice. okay. Yeah, see, he's aware of him using the double jump armor to get out of PK fire, so he's just positioning himself to get the punish afterwards. Very good stuff. And, uh, yeah, Burst is really struggling to make up for that right now. <laughs> Even using the side magic to clank with the egg, that was actually really smart recovery. TM4's recoveries in general have been very good. Like... Normally, Ness is uh, very susceptible off stage, but TM4 mixes up very well to the point where he can just come back almost every time. Not a hard punish on that. Still living here. Potentially can get the two stock if he plays his cards right. Almost. Dying to the dash attack here first, just trying to find anything to get this stock, but yeah, TM4 pressure just not stopping at all, and he's he's out of here. Yeah, well, how would a bad time? <laughs> yeah, that was he like teleported to the blast zone. Like there was no kill screen. There was like <laughs> he's was, he was gone. He was gone, man. I guess the answer everybody is like, why doesn't Nintendo update their servers? I mean, look, they're the most profitable video game company in Japan and just video games. Sony exists um, as an entertainment company as well. I'm pretty sure their mentality more or less is if it's not broke, don't fix it because what we need to do is maximize our profits. That's more than half the reason why. You're in business to make money. So if something's broken and not and still runs, that's their mentality, you know? It, it, it's kind of like, it kind of makes sense, you know? So we'll see, man, I don't know. The servers are getting updated later this month. So we'll, think, we'll see how things uh, change when that happens. Thanks to Capcom and Monster Hunter Rise, the servers are getting finally updated. So, first time seeing Burst's uh, Inkling come out tonight, and kind of figures that it's against uh, this matchup so far. Like, he's just been really having a rough time with Yoshi. But uh, I gotta say, I'm wondering how warmed up the Inkling is. Uh, I think Inkling's an amazing character, but you have to play very well 
uh, to do well with the character. Like, you, you can't really make too many mistakes or miss your percentage windows for the up throw up air as well. It, it can just be very difficult to kill otherwise. But, the opportunity here. Luckily for him, with Inkling, he just has so many good ways to edge guard Ness in safe ways as well. So once he, you know, gets an opportunity, he can really capitalize. But, dang, the up smash coming out from TM4. Oh, there's oh. the berry, fourth smash? Roller, yeah. roller from almost full screen. Okay, okay. <laughs> we'll take it. Had all the time in the world to shield that. Nice. Nice stream there coming out from burst. Yeah, 46%. Good, big lead here against TM4. Well, not necessarily a big lead, but just a lead here on TM4. PK Thunder to kind of stop Burst in the movement here. There's the roller from the side here, and that's good for Burst to get the Nair and the, wow. almost the corner carry. Nearly missing the mark, but that's big Jeez, for TM4 surprised. because he gets the side stall back air. TM4 is not going to let Burst this, touch the stage this, for long. Yeah, this movement from TM4, very good. His use of the side magnet has just been impeccable. I honestly, person's just, he's really got to find a way to slow this nest down, but nice use of this flat bomb. Oh, but straight to the ledge. Wow, the side magnet going through everything. I couldn't tell if he healed off of that or not, but that was a really good use of the down B to get past that ledge trap. Oh, nice. PA flash again. Just really making the ledge super, super rough to deal with man like that's usually where inkling has a lot of power is keeping you pressured at the ledge but cm4 is, has so much control there doesn't give me up there though oh yeah usually oh, your opponent okay. would be trying to mash like sdi out or jump out of pk fire so that's good for tm4 to just immediately go for forward air even if you miss you're still crossing up inkling at worst all right neutral there what a oh. play! Got out. What oh, a play, no. dude! He faked out the grab, and then he just goes for up smash. <sighs> what a play! Damn, that was unlucky for burst. It yeah, looked like cause... he actually got out of the the up smash at first, but then he fell back into it. <laughs>